This is a SnapEd New York video presentation. Welcome to the kitchen. Today we are going to make slow cooker lean turkey chili. Today we are going to use just 10 ingredients, many of which you probably already have in your pantry. One and a quarter pounds of lean ground turkey, one onion, one clove of garlic, one and a half cups frozen corn kernels or low sodium canned corn, a red and a green bell pepper, a 28 ounce can of crushed tomatoes, a can of black beans rinsed and drained, a can of tomato sauce, and one package of chili seasoning mix, just to keep it simple. If you don't already have any of these ingredients on hand, this recipe will cost you about $12.50. My name is Erica Dahl, and I am a SNAP-Ed Nutrition Educator. The SNAP-Ed program provides you with tips, tricks, and ideas about how to save money and save time, all while eating healthy and being physically active. I'm excited to be here today with my colleague Bintu to talk to you about how slow cooker turkey chili can help us eat in the my plate meal pattern. So one of the important food groups of the my plate is the protein food group. And it's really important for optimal nutrition to be as healthy as we can be to make sure we're varying the types of proteins that we eat every day. It's also important to make sure half of our plate at every meal is fruits and vegetables. So the slow cooker turkey chili recipe is a great way to incorporate lots of vegetables and all the nutrition they provide, while also using two different kinds of protein. Bintu, what are you cooking up for us? Hi, my name is Bintu and I'm a snap and nutritionist. Welcome to my kitchen. Let's get cooking. Don't forget as you get started to wash your hands. Wet them with clean running water, then lather your hands by rubbing them together with soap for at least 20 seconds. Rinse your hands under clean running water and dry them with a towel. I chose this recipe because not only is it loaded with colorful vegetables, but it allows me to switch around my protein with lean meat and even black beans. I kept it tasty and healthy by using the crock pot to infuse the dish with flavor without adding extra fat or extra calories. To make this recipe as heart healthy as possible, keep the protein lean by selecting at least 93% lean ground turkey. And of course, using beans is a great way to get some plant-based protein in your diet. This recipe is also great to help us fill up on fruits and vegetables. There is a huge variety of fruits and vegetables in this chili. Okay, this is the first step that's going to make your house smell amazing. In a large skillet over medium high heat, add your turkey, your onion, and your garlic. Adding onion and garlic is a heart healthy way to infuse the dish with flavor without adding salt. Then you're going to stir until the turkey crumbles and is no longer pink. It should look like this. Can you smell it yet? Next, we are going to spoon the mixture into our slow cooker. Then we are going to add all of our other ingredients. These vegetables are an important source of many nutrients, including potassium, dietary fiber, folate, vitamin A, and vitamin C. Eating a diet rich in vegetables reduces your risk for heart disease, including heart attack and stroke. These red and green peppers help support our vision and our immune system. Bintu is using a variety of colorful vegetables in this recipe. The crushed tomatoes and tomato sauce are an especially good source of vitamin C, which also supports our immune system, cardiovascular health, and is even great for our skin. You can make this recipe even more nutritious by selecting no salt added canned tomato products. Bintu is adding no salt added tomato sauce to the crock pot. 
Corn is a great source of dietary fiber, which can support our digestive system by helping us stay regular and keeping us feeling full and satisfied. These beans do double duty here, providing an additional source of dietary fiber and lean protein, helping this dish to be both filling and satisfying. Our crock pot is now full of a huge variety of colors. To make this recipe as heart healthy as possible, we are choosing a low sodium seasoning mix. But you may have some of these ingredients in your pantry already. So this packet is the equivalent of two to three tablespoons of chili powder, one to two teaspoons of cumin, and one teaspoon of paprika. Don't be afraid to flavor it your way. Once all of your ingredients are in your slow cooker, it should look like this. Mix all of the ingredients that are in your slow cooker until well blended. Then simply pop on the top. You have options here. You can set your slow cooker to high for four to five hours or low for six to eight hours depending on time. And finally, spoon the chili into bowls and serve. A serving size of this chili is one cup. Or you can make this into a heartier my plate meal with grains and dairy. You can serve over a quarter cup of brown rice and top with one tablespoon of low fat cheese. Chili is an excellent meal to prepare in advance because of the way that it freezes. You can freeze it in batches and warm it up on the stove later as a quick, easy, nutritious meal for your family another night of the week. Thank you, Bintu, for showing us how easy it can be to prepare a meal that can help us fill up on fruits and vegetables and vary our proteins. What I also like about this recipe is that you can store it in one cup serving sizes and have healthy meals for later as well. Thank you so much for joining us today. For this recipe and other ways that you can eat healthy and be active while saving time and money, please visit snapbedny.org. Or you can follow us on social media on Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube. Have a great day. Thank you for joining us today. We know the healthy choice isn't always the easiest choice, but small changes can make a big difference. Start today by getting involved with Snap Ed New York. This program is free for those who qualify or receive SNAP benefits. We want to help you save time, save money, and eat healthy. Learn how SNAP Ed can make a difference in your life. For more information and to find your local program, visit snapedny.org. This material is funded by USDA's Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program. SNAP, this institution is an equal opportunity provider.